gameplay experience. Quest 2 versus Quest 3. Go. I am not allowed to say right now. <laughs> Maybe we'll uh, <laughs> release that another time. Um, so what I can say is that I can talk about the menu, right? So I can't talk about... I played a whole bunch of old stuff, but I can't talk about that. So um, what I did play, I played around with the menu, played around with the browser. Everything was really, really fluid, right? So like, it's kind of like if you've ever used a 60 hertz mobile phone screen or cell phone screen difference between that and like a 90 or 120 hertz display like it's just like silky smooth like liquid and that's what all the menus and the browser experience felt like the other thing that i would say is the first thing that you experience when you put on uh, a quest 3 is that you look at the text and you see how sharp it is i would equate it to the hp reverb g2 which had what a lot of people called eagle eye vision where you felt like you had a superpower Unfortunately, with the HP Reverb G2, the controllers were fat and battery heavy. I think it was two AA batteries in each one. They were just fat rings. They looked kind of stupid. And, um, well, the Quest 3 has the new touch controllers without the tracking rings. So they're really sleek. They're really small. And one of the important things and from a gameplay perspective is you can really travel with this thing. It's even smaller than the Oculus Go was, which is something that, to me has been a real big problem for Quest 1 and Quest 2 when you try to travel with it. You have this silly looking like bean case that they sell. And I have the official cases, but they've always been a uh, bit annoying. So my, my suggestion is, let's get the official case if you can, uh, because it's shaped like a pod and it just accentuates like, it's too big. It, it's not, it doesn't need to be that big. Get a small like uh, rectangular shaped uh, camera case that'll fit it go into a camera shop or something and man that thing packs away like a tiny little piece you can put that in a carry-on no problem uh, so it's going to be my travel buddy and absolutely be used for gaming on the go